Greetings, everyone. Saludos y respetos, everyone, on YouTube. Excuse me on the tear. Dispensa la tira. That's right. Well, check this out, man. We got a good topic today. We're going to talk about California City. That's right. California City is uh, in uh, the Mojave Desert. It's a small city in, the, in Kern County, I believe. Yeah, um... We're going to, uh, I'm going to run it through, you know, um, there's been local corruption. Unfortunately, uh, 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 somebody got at me, you know, uh, needs help. You know, we need to get the word out there, you know, uh, you know, stop these, these um, cops, you know, that are protect, uh, that are there to protect and serve, you know, to stop harassing, you know, our local people, you know, especially parolees or ex-parolees, convicts or people that look like you and I. You know what I mean? Our skin color. They want to put us back. You know, how are we going to succeed in life, get a job or move forward when they're just picking at, picking at, picking at the bear? You know, you know, they hate us driving a nice car. They hate us paying our bills. They hate us buying a house. You know, they, they want to see us in prison. They want to see us, uh, uh, on the floor and and that's not cool man you know it's time for us rasa to unite come together and help each other out and if we could get together and voice our opinions and let it be known that we're also human because there's no difference between us and a cop authority or anyone else we're all equal we're all the same we all breathe the same air all right you two friends thanks for your time and uh, I hope you like this. And uh, yep, let's get ready. Check this out. Hope you like. It. <laughs> Yo, I'm back. For those of you who don't know what excuse me on the tear or dispensa la tira means, when you're in prison and you want to talk to someone in a different cell, for people to quiet down, you got to say that first before you uh, get at someone in a different cell. Out of respect, pretty much. So in other words, allow me to get your attention with all respect. California City, officially the city of California City and formally abbreviated to Cal City, is a city incorporated in 1965, located in the Northern Anano Valley in Kern County, California, United States. The population was 14,120 at the census in 2010. So the purpose of this video is to enlighten the corruption the unfair, unprofessional work that these cops are doing. Check out this following video. This is a, a very good friend of mine named David, David Hanna, who has been harassed, who keeps getting harassed. David and his wife have a home, a humble home, and live peacefully, minding their own business when these cops are still harassing looking for something that's not there unfortunately they're here to protect and serve but what is it when you're playing tricks planting guns and drugs on people that are trying to better their lives this is for officer holtz cabreas david is no longer on parole probation he complied with the rules and regulations, he's a free man. Ladies and gentlemen, David Hanna got set up by these cops. Unfortunately, they don't want him to succeed in life. He's out on bail now, facing these unfortunate charges. Now, if this man has to go away, who's gonna take care of his family? Is this satisfying you? We're getting pulled over for no reason again. Window doesn't roll down. Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, I think I remember you. 
Yeah, you remember. Yeah, you remember us. That's why you pulled us over again for no reason. Okay, I pulled you over because you just want your hands on me. And I just pulled you over because your center brake light is out. Okay? My center brake light? Yeah, the roof brake light. Um, I don't remember your name. Do you have your ID on you? Oh. This is harassment. <clears throat> Nope. nope. They don't give us a ticket. Oh. Same cops that pulled us over last time. He says he doesn't know. He knows exactly who we I'm are. He's saying our brake light. He knows exactly who we are. I know he does. He knows exactly where we live. That's why he looks nervous right now. Nothing better to do, do they? No, this is... I'm glad they did this. Same cop. And he knows me. Yeah, he don't remember your name. He knows where we live. They fucking followed us to the house to pull us over last time. And that's what they thought we were going to do this time. It's harassment. You did his face in there. I did. Same break right on that like why didn't they give us a ticket for that last time man? Exactly. Exactly. They're nitpicking. This is Officer Holst. He's no, he's not on probation, and I can show you a picture of him getting off probation papers. Okay, well, he's not, and I have a picture. This is also the other Officer Cabreas who pulled us over last time and harassed us. Um, he's not on probation. I have a picture of it in this okay. phone that can show you that he got off okay. probation on November 4th. Okay, I'm not doubting you at all. Okay, because sometimes that happens where the issue... Uh, well, I have a picture, and this is exactly why the PO sent it. So that I can show it if we get pulled over, and you guys can't do this. Okay. It's against the law. All right, we'll figure it out. Do you have the PO's number so that I can speak with him? Yeah, but he's not going to answer his phone in the middle of the night. Sometimes I do. It's, not, it's, not, it's still early. But until then, I'm going to have you step out, okay? Well, I'm recording all this okay. shit. How many times are you going to search the same shit? You going to keep us here all night? I'm almost done. Get you out of here. Just take care of that break. Yeah. Go I'll walk to the store so I don't get pulled over. How tight are the handcuffs? Last time you chopped the shit out of his wrist. Picture proof. What? Babe, get in the car. Take out that uniform, bitch. Take it off. Come on, babe. Babe, get in the car now. David, David, they're trying to antagonize you so you do something. Well, bitch, that's all you are. Don't speed. Don't. Can I drive? He's going to find a reason to pull us over again. But it's all good because I'm going to record this whole ride right now. So they can say that we're speeding and driving recklessly. I don't want to pull up in the driveway. They're not going in the house. 
If they're going to the house, I'm taking off on one of them. No, you're not. I'll record it. You know what? Don't pull in. The, don't pull in the driveway. Go to Fast Trip. We'll eat at Fast Trip. Yeah, they're still there waiting. Go to Fast Trip. Uh, this shit right here. That fool wants to act like he don't know who the fuck I am. He knew exactly who we are. Both of them did. They're actually still sitting there waiting for us. <sighs> to what? Go to our house so they can come try to search our house? Just sitting there like idiots. Okay, okay and that's how come time. once again, once again, you didn't get a ticket for nothing? That's what, that's what I'm trying to tell you. That's what I'm telling you. This is gonna work. This is gonna work. Trust me. This is this is not something that we're doing wrong, dude. When, when he said why, when I said why'd you pull me over? Mm -hmm. You had it filming? Yeah. Okay. He said because you have brake light out. Yes. Okay. That's harassment. Uh, all he needs to do is say. I pulled and you, you told him. Listen, all you need to say is you're on probation. That's why I pulled you over. Right, but you know what? You're not on probation. I showed them proof, and they still continue to search the I truck. Know. I'm telling you, this this needs to happen. I want them to do this shit. I wish my son was with us this time. I know. Just go park in one of the parking spots, Dad. <sighs> They have must. They must have a little clicker, like where they could turn the fucking uh, what do you call it, on and off, the fucking uh, uh, Camera. uh cameras. Cause he goes right now. He goes, oh, go go chase your heroin or something. I said, oh yeah, motherfucker, what's up, bitch? Go chase your heroin, huh? That's what he said. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, live and direct. You heard it with your own ears, seen it with your own eyes. Unfortunate. Unfortunately for David, Hannah, and his wife, it's kind of messed up that they're not able to pull up to their house and eat their dinner. As you can see, they had to go to the local gas station to park and eat. But uh, thanks for your time. Please uh, subscribe, comment, or like right here on YouTube. I appreciate your time and support. And if we could, you know, uh, come together as one and help out David or anyone knows any lawyers or, or someone that knows the law that could help us. Uh, there's more more to the story. Uh, maybe if we could contact people that could help us, leave us a comment and, and we'll get you in contact with David. But he does need help. And th this needs to stop because we got a, a lot of good people coming out of jail that want to better themselves. And 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 it's kind of messed up that these cops, uh, the authority, you know, uh, wants to put us back in jail. I know it's job security, but don't you don't have to cheat, you don't have to uh, uh, play dirty to get us back in there, man. There's a lot of us that are done with that. We want to uh, improve ourselves. We want to uh, enjoy life, the freedom, you know, uh, our families, you know. Anyhow, I hope you liked this video. Thank you, everyone. Good luck, David. Much love and respect. This is Manny, that Jaguar Paul. I'm out. Buenas no.